This might be the best and most exciting table saw fence I've seen in years, and it will likely fit on your saw. Check this out. I'm here with Jeremy Rowe with Harvey Tools. Hey, man. He's gonna show us a cool new fence they have that'll fit a lot of table saws, not just theirs. All right, so this is our big eye rip fence system that we're really proud of, and we debuted at the AWFS show this year. It's got a lot of cool features, so we'll come around and show you what we got. So one problem that all woodworkers face with their table saw fence is sometimes there's a little slop on the far end, and you can't always trust it to be true 90. But that's not a problem anymore with the rip fence system. It's got dual locking mechanisms on the front and back rail. So once you lock this in, there's no movement, there's no slop on this far end. You've got a smooth glide system. Other features are micro adjustments up to a thousandth. We've got a crystal glass sight viewer here so there's no visual obstructions. And then you'll also see we've got integrated flip stops for positive stops all along the table saw for your repetitive cuts. So if precision and accuracy is important to you on the table saw, this rip fence system is gonna treat you right. If you have a saw stop, this will bolt right on. Absolutely, we prefer it on a Harvey saw, but it will fit universally yeah. on, on other saws, absolutely. Awesome, and this has a unique feature for fellas, right? Yeah, yeah no, more, the... no more hitting uh, this area. Yeah, this so area. solid stainless steel handle, milled construction, so everything's 90 as soon as you bolt it up to the, the rail. Nice. And you said, this, is this plastic or glass? No, this is a crystal. So it's really like, glass. Like an eyeglass quality crystal. So you don't have to worry about that getting scuffed and scratched like regular nope. plastic. And There's no skewing of the actual measurement. Oh. We've also got a high-low fence system. So right now we're in the high fence mode, but this can come off. And now Smooth you're in too. low fence mode for thin stock or specialty cuts. And on the gauge, we've got a high fence oh, it says high on there. gauge. Oh, and if you change to low mode, all you have to do is slide your rule to low oh, mode. You set that once, and then you never have to mess with it again. That's pretty cool. Y'all also have a new miter gauge that upgraded to the Compass, right? We upgraded our already world-class miter gauge to the MG36 Pro. Pro. Some of the extra features is we added more positive stops for your angles on the underside. We added this micro adjustment vernier scale for even finer tuning precision. You've still got the micro adjustment on the arm got to increase capacity on the width and you've got more contact points along the miter gauge itself so really the takeaway here is that we improved our already great miter gauge and we listened to customer feedback and added all these features to improve it yeah and this is also so you can put a sacrificial fence on now that's right yeah that's one last feature we added this second kind of elbow in in the arm so that you can you can add a little more width if you want to for a sacrificial fence. Awesome. If you don't have one of these, you gotta check them out. They're awesome. All right, man. Thanks yep. so much, man. Yep, absolutely. I have some really cool tools to show you that I saw at AWFS Fair coming soon. Be sure to hit that subscribe button.